I cannot stress this enough. Please, please, please do not. And I mean, do not try this at home. You will regret it. It's not worth it. Just trust me. Yo, guys. So I was letting the letting the light pedal, whatever the word is that I'm looking for. Today's video is going to be a nice banger, like always. We're going to be doing another review on another product this time. It is a product that gets you high, but it gets you high in a completely different way. I know I said before I'm not going to do it again. It's being eat gummies. But here we are, eating some gummies. These gummies, though, these have mushrooms in them. Come on, mushroom blend. We've got these blue boomer glow pop mushroom blends. I got the same flavor, Tropical Twist. I got two packs. We carry a couple different flavors, but I heard the blue lemonade and the strawberry weren't that great. So we went with Tropical Twist. And it's honestly, it ain't about flavor today. It's about how high I get. Could have got three packs, just went for the two. We're going to eat both of them because fuck it. There's 10 in the pack. I got told by coworker that he ate five and five got him pretty good. So he told me to do 10. So I'm going to do 20 and hopefully their balls. Problem is, is that's a lot of gummies again. Probably going to get the shits again. We're just going to, we're going to try one, give it a little flavor, try a couple more, give it a little flavor. And then we're going to go ham. This video is going to be a real short one because it's all about the after effects. They're pretty big actually. Wow. Mm. They're like normal fruit snack gummy. They don't taste that bad. Kind of tastes like, it's weird because these aren't the strawberry ones, but they taste like strawberry fruit leather. Just like strawberry fruit leather almost. With a little weird like after bite. But it tastes good. I like it. I like it way better than the, the other gummies I had. And they're only 10 calories per gummy. So it's 200 calories. That's, that's, that's a fair chunk, but nothing crazy. I ain't too worried about that. These gummies have Blue Lotus, I know for sure, Lion's Mane, and Ro... Ro God, I'm going to butcher the shit out of this. Rodiola. Ro Rodiola? Yeah, something like that. So yeah, Blue Lotus, Lion's Mane, Rodiola. There's probably some other mushrooms in here as well. Actually, no. Just Lion's Mane, Blue Lotus, and Rodiola. I like these gummies, though. We're going to just go to town on them. So here in a couple hours, we'll see how I'm feeling. But uh, the problem is my recording device is a webcam the lighting device is the sun it is 4 15 here in four hours it's going to be 8 15 that's probably what i'm going to be like feeling it pretty hard but the sun's going to start going down pretty hard too and my lighting's going to go to shit i think my best bet is to do take like good notes on how i feel and then we'll do another video in the morning we're still going to take these all on camera though. do not worry i just took two we're going to go down and we're just going to pop as many as we can fit. That was five. Blah, blah, blah. They're weird tasting. So it's not particularly something that's like you want to pound down like a fruit snack would be. But they're not bad. They're just weird. And I don't know why, but my brain is just like, you don't like this, even though it's not bad at all. The gummy and the kill clip's kind of a weird combo, not gonna lie. I can't open this. Two thousand years later. There we go. I just pulled on it and got it off. We got another bottle. I wish I would have got another flavor to give it a try. But I heard the other one sucked, so not really wanting to try something that sucks. Just down ten. Got ten more. I'm kinda nervous about taking these, not gonna lie, because I don't know how my innards are gonna feel. My innards are, have already been pretty rough since those gummies. We already said we're gonna take them though. Okay, let's do it. Fuck it. Okay, this is what I'll say. I do not like eating all this candy all the fucking time. I don't even eat that much normal candy, really. I like it, and I'll smack some Sour Patch Kids or some Swedish Fish, but I can't do the gummies no more. To get to a level of what I'm wanting to get to, I feel like I gotta eat too many. Man, I think this is probably the highest dose of these anyone's ever taken. What if I die? I don't think I'm gonna die. I just hope I don't get sick. I got work in the morning. 
I'm already starting to sweat. I don't know if that's just because it's hot though or what, because it's only been like two minutes. And I haven't even eaten all of them. I got three left. After these three, I'm going to show you guys my two empty jars. You hear that? Nothing. You want to know why? They're empty. 20 mushroom gummies. Down. Like I said before, five was the number that people have said they've taken and gotten them trippy. 10 was the number I was recommended. I generally like to double my recommended number. In theory, I get fucked up. That's the goal, at least. If that doesn't happen, it's okay. It is what it is. Oh, yo, guys, I'm back. What's going on? It's been like just under 30 minutes since I took those shrooms. Um, pupils are not any crazy dilated. I just wanted to put a little input in. I, I thought I was going to go play video games and go fart around for the next however long, right? No, I have like the most extreme body high right now. Like it's just like in the back of my body though. Like it's everywhere though, all the way down to my fingertips, my head, my chest, my stomach, everything is an extreme body high. Like I took equivalent to like an eighth of mushrooms. I'd say when you first take it, you know, and you're like 20 minutes in just like I am right now. And so I'm, I have some pretty high hopes for this shit. Cause like I said, I'm tripping or not tripping. I'm body high. I'm feeling that body high, like crazy right now without any of the negative, crazy, like yawning. And I say that as I yawn, Oh, maybe I'm, maybe I'm just too soon. Oh no. All right. But none of, so far besides that one, none of the yawning and all that other bullshit that comes from taking a bunch of shrooms. So I think these are pretty dope, actually. Besides the fact that I had to spend 60 bucks to get two packs and then had to eat them all. But hey, I'm feeling it pretty fucking hard. Yo, guys, what's going on? It's been what? Two and a half hours? Three and a half hours? Three and a half hours since I took those mushrooms. And let me tell you, them shits hit me like, let's see. I, my pupils are kind of dilated, but not like they were before. I should have came back sooner. I'm sorry for that. Let me just tell you, they it wasn't like a crazy visual trip. It was more of like, like a blurry vision kind of trip. It's still actually going on right now. But it's the equivalent of like what I would say an eighth of some like pretty weak normal mushrooms though. Like I've taken an eighth of some mushrooms and I was like, man, these didn't even really hit me that hard. Like what the fuck? But they were mushrooms and that's kind of how I feel right now. Going through this, like watching myself, I'm seeing uh, tracers and shit. This is definitely an experience to try again. We'll probably come back in the the morning once we're completely sober to to decide or not not to decide, but to talk about how how things went. Because right now, like I can't tell if my lighting is fucked up or if I'm just tripping still. You know what I'm saying? Thank you guys so much for joining me. I will. I don't know why I say this because we're coming back. Oh. Yo guys, hold on, let's close the window a little bit. We're back. What was it, two days ago? You guys saw me take those mushroom gummies and you're probably like, what, two days ago? What took so long? I got sick as fuck, like throwing up terrible sick. Like I probably threw up 15 times and dry heaved another like 30. It was not good. I'm not going to 100% blame the gummies on that one though. I obviously don't know what exactly happened. So I'm just going to tell you guys kind of the story of how my day went, went out, right? I got those gummies from work, popped them on camera. You guys saw that. It was like four o'clock in the afternoon, played some video games, felt great. The mushrooms were hitting perfect. Everything was good. Honestly, there was no problem, right? It was a normal mushroom experience. Like I didn't feel hungry because of them. Just like normal mushrooms. I was feeling euphoric. I wasn't tripping hard visually, but like everything was good, right? 7.30 comes around eight o'clock. I can't really remember. I had a Philly cheesesteak sandwich that was, I had got like earlier that day at like three, four o'clock, you know, and it had got cold, obviously sitting here on my desk. I ate that. I fucking macked that hoe. And then by like one o'clock in the morning, guys, I was growing up so bad it was the worst time of my life like i threw up six or seven times and then i felt fine you know so i was like oh maybe it was food poisoning maybe it was that philly cheesesteak bullshit you know and so i was like damn that really sucks not going to that place again but like i said because like i said i felt fine probably like 45 minutes later 
I threw up again another like six or seven times. And I was just like, Jesus fucking Christ, what's going on? Right. And I was like, maybe it wasn't food poisoning. Maybe it was like mushrooms, you know, feeling like shit. So I threw up, like I said, two o'clock, two thirty rolls around. Didn't feel that great again. I was in bed from 2.30 to like 5.30 in the morning, just every 30 minutes over a trash can, dry heaving, because I, I had nothing in my stomach at this point. So it's just dry heaving up, just like small amount of stomach acid and spit and just bullshit, whatever. A little bit of blood even. It was really not, not good. Not good at all. I do not know if it was the mushroom gummies. I do not know if it was the Philly cheese stick. I don't know if it was a mixture of both. All I know is that shit had me fucking dead. So just whatever you do, if you decide to eat mushroom gummies and you decide to take 10, 20, whatever, don't eat a Philly cheesesteak that you had sitting on your desk for four hours. Cause uh, yeah, you might not like the, the, the feeling afterwards. Either way, I'm probably just going to chalk it up to don't go to the place you got the Philly cheesesteak from. Don't eat any more mushroom gummies at like that level of craziness. Maybe try like five just call it good besides that guys like it was truly a great experience like it was phenomenal up until i was throwing up like i was feeling great i was feeling fine actually like i had no problems and then like midnight is when my stomach really started like oh my stomach kind of hurts like oh maybe i shouldn't eat that philly cheesesteak oh you know and then it was just bad like i it was it was so bad that like my mom was even going like, I'm going to take you to the hospital. And I was like, no, don't take me to the hospital. I'm fine. I'm just not fine. I did have to miss work yesterday because of it, because I was up until 5 30, 6 o'clock in the morning throwing up, woke up at nine in the morning for work and just mm -mm, couldn't do it. I was too tired. I was, I felt like shit. Couldn't eat anything all day yesterday. I couldn't really like do anything. I just kind of hung out at the house. I feel fine now though. I feel great. I think whatever it was, it's it's gone now. It's flushed out. We're all good. Regular mushrooms make you sick enough. I might as well just stick to those because I've taken an eighth of mushrooms and I threw up like once or twice. You know, that was 15 times and then like 30 dry heaves, which sucks, bro. I, I really just want to have a good time. And every time I try to have a good time, I end up not having a good time because even when I had a good time off the mushroom gummies, I ended up not having a good fucking time. Like, I don't understand. I guess that's all I got for you guys, though. We we covered everything that happened. We took the gummies. They were great. I legitimately tripped. I just didn't have visual tripping. I had, like, more of a body high. There was a, a slight bit of visuals. Colors were more vibrant and all that good jazz. But nothing crazy like an actual mushroom trip. Besides that, the, the body high and everything, like, the euphoria was great. Absolutely great. The fact that I ate them and got super sick. But I also ate Philly cheesesteak that was a couple hours old. Could have been that. Could have been the mushrooms. I, I, I don't know. The restaurant that I got the Philly cheesesteak from wasn't like a packed restaurant. Like, for all I know, that was the problem, right? Also, I got the hiccups. This sucks. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Truthfully, I, I really appreciate you guys. Um, thanks for all the likes, the comments, everything. Don't forget to subscribe. All that good jazz. Check me out on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash Who's Your Toddy. Check me out on Instagram. Uh, Instagram at Who's Your Toddy. All that's going to be linked down below. You know how it is. All right. I'll see y'all later. Thanks for watching. Bye.